Hi folks, Mark and Cheryl from Adventuremen Tear Drop Campers. Today we're going to show you a new van of ours, version 2, 2022 model, the X10, the Adventuremen X10. This is the largest, most off roady style tear drop that we build, and uh, I think you're going to like some of the stuff we see. Come in and I'll, I'll show you what's going on with this one. 15 inch 235 tyres, we can have mud trains or all terrains, 8 inch jockey wheel. This one has an electric brake, electric brake system. They come standard with electric brakes. Lowered coupling point. We can have any coupling here we wish. Twin chains, nice strong frame, handbrake. In here is our fridge. So easy to operate. Look at that, one finger. This is a 40 litre fridge just on display today. Works a treat. So simple. Push and pack away. That looks really good. On the top of this aluminium box, You'll see a tie down racking system. Tie down some bags of firewood, camp chairs, and stuff like that. Really cool for doing that. This is a bolt on panel, too. That's solid. Uh, 9 mm ply. So you can actually bolt something onto it if you ever wish to. Now we've got new doors. These are new doors to Adventureman. Crimp safe mesh doors, triple locks, worker treat. Split system. Lock back like that. These guys lock over here, so at night time it's uh, a few, obviously curtains in there, um, and they just work so well. Uh, very happy with those doors. Big windows, now we've got new lighting too, we've got white lighting, and noisy repellent lighting. So that's a real cool thing that we're doing just at the moment. As you see this one's got step up plates, the suspension on this one is a solid 45mm square axle, tangential electric brakes, we can we have mag wheels on this one uh, which is an optional upgrade and we have very strong leaf spring suspension uh, as i said with 10 inch electric brakes uh, big mud flat big wide tough guards tough tough stand-ons this thing is all about as tough as they can get for a teardrop style camper now on this one we have access to the storage bin from the side you know, there's a bit of our camping gear in there if you come around to the back, this is our back hatch, our galley area. You'll notice we have bench tops. So the access is down through the bench top into the back section. Tons and tons of storage in this area. And it's a beautiful butcher's block style bench top as well. Over here we've got, in here we've got white lighting and mozzie as well. Overhead cabinetry, more than enough space through here to put your dailies. Over here in the corner, the little thunderbox, it tells you your readout of your power, US twin USB, cigarette eye socket, and Anderson, should you wish to run anything back here. So that's really basic and simple, but it does the job very well. Um, I'm a tallish guy, as most people know. Plenty of clearance there. As you notice with this one too, all of these adventures come with a rollout 2.5 or 2.5 Raven awning um, as standard. This one's been upgraded. We've moved the Raven over to the other side. And we've put the Falcon Batwing style awning on here. And as you can see, what a fantastic thing. Three minutes set up. You can buy walls for it. You can now buy walls with screens or walls that are solid. Um, just a no brainer, this one. Okay, around here, as I said, we have the 230 Raven rollout awning. And underneath that, we now have the 230 drop down shower change room. These have lights, places for your um, soaps and shampoos. They have brackets to hold your, your water system. We just use a drop in a bucket powered little water system. Works absolutely fabulous. And that one's good for getting changed too when you're in a scenario of um, lots of small kids near you in camp and you want a bit of privacy to get changed. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll show you all the center in there, in, in the center there in a second. Now around here, this is where your battery is. Now we're using a quite a comprehensive little battery box. It also has a quick voltage checker, and we're using the new Kickass 22 amp smart lithium and AGM compatible charger. So, as most people already use an AGM style battery, you can just drop in a lithium battery into that one at any point of time, and that charge is ready for a lithium battery. 240 volt is an option should you choose to need it. And there's plugs there where you can put in uh, a solar panel. All right, you guys head around and I'll show you the inside of the van. Okay, 
Okay, so in this van it's a 50 mil uh, earthwork insulated interior. We have reading lights, as you can see. And these are dimmable too, they're quite a cool little thing. Uh, and that's an ambient setting, so you know where that is in the middle of the night. Drink holders, heat windows, 800 by 500 windows. They come with a Sirocco night fan, which is virtually silent and points in any direction, and a roof vent. And here we have the cabinetry, which runs right through the other side. Secret of these vans is 220 millimeter inner spring mattress, the crown in our jewel. This throws absolute comfort um, in these vans. Up there too is a uh, smoke alarm and a fire extinguisher. Overhead pockets are also a really cool feature too to quickly throwing in um, sunglasses and wallets and stuff like that. So righto guys, uh, let's just um, I'll head back around the front. Okay, so benchmentier.campus, YouTube, Instagram, uh, Facebook, have a look at the sites, give us a call should you want one of these, $17,900 in 2022's money, uh, is the starting basic price for one of these units. Thank you very much and we'll chat when we do.